Massive match on the weekend, mate. All that attack. Um, yeah, I think you need, you need to be careful because I think you know you can you can quite easily lose a game in the first half rather than win it sometimes. So I think we need to be um, be patient. Uh, you know, play play our own game. I think our football has been quite good in the last couple of weeks. Um, you know, with just that crucial moments, we've probably let ourselves down a little bit. So I think. Um, you know, keep keep going as we have been, and and um, be positive. Just stay positive the whole time, and and um, you know, if we're good enough, we'll we'll, we'll get the, the the win. The fact that they need to just get a draw to, to win the Premier's play, do you feel that they might you know sit back a little bit early? No, I don't think so. I think the you know the way they've played has not really changed much from the first game of the season till now. They've um, they've actually got better every week, and um, you know they're very well organised. They know their their roles individually and as a team, and I, I don't think they'll. Um, deviate too far from the from the usual game plan they're, they're difficult to break down anyway so um, you know we just need to again concentrate on our own game and, and stay positive from the from, right from the start. Massive contingent of Wanderers fans travelling up north I mean I suppose you know if, if the side's not up for this game they never will be. Yeah I think it's fantastic I think um, the the West Sydney as a club this year have been um, you know excellent for the competition and the league and their supporters have added a, an extra dimension to all their games particularly the home games but they've travelled a lot um, in, in New South Wales as well, so I think for us it's a it's a good opportunity. It's a it's a big crowd. It's an important game, and um, you know for the players that's what you um, that's what you play for. Great to see Heskey moving more free out there. Yeah, no, it's good to have him back. I think he gives a lot of confidence to the to the team, and uh, you know his presence um, defensively at set pieces and things like that's a, a, a bonus for us. Uh, West Sydney's a big team, and um, you know have a few aerial threats. So just you know plenty of aspects of a meals game that um, that gives us a big. Big confidence boost. I don't know, Shin Janonio, we don't think. I mean, he's having scans today, but you wouldn't think they'd, they'd risk him. Does that take a bit of silk away from him, a bit of that X factor? Or? Uh, well, they still have Aaron Moy, um, Mark Bridgie. Bridgie's a, a clever player, so Hersey comes back in, so, you know, um, they get they lose their, their marquee player, but they also gain a couple of, um, you know, very good attacking weapons anyway. So, again, for us, it's just important to be focused on our, our own performance and, um, you know, hopefully it takes care of itself. The video session today, I know that they're very strong on the, on the counter attack. Was that the video session designed to emphasise the importance of not turn the ball over? Um, yeah, we just had a look at our, uh, the game in Adelaide and, and um, you know, how we can be a little bit better in transition moments from, you know, when we have the ball, we're quite comfortable at the moment when we have the ball, but in transition, um, you know, just the decision making in split seconds is maybe letting us down a little bit. So it's just more about um, having a look at those moments and, and West Sydney, as you said, being a good counter-attacking team, if you don't get those things right, then um, it's going to cost you on the day. Uh, it looks like you've got a full squad, everyone trained, uh, and then even Candice training. Yeah. When, when are you envisaging many changes or will it be pretty much the no, core I don't. Of what's no, I think we've had a pretty stable squad for probably the last six or eight weeks and I think it's um, shown on the, um, with the performances, the results, you know, we haven't really probably got the points that we, we wanted to and, and maybe we've even deserved at times, but I think the performances have been quite, um, quite stable and, and quite good. So I think, you know, to make massive changes at, at this point in time is not probably the best idea. Like Gary in the past has had a trick up his sleeve or two for big games, so yeah. there's nothing in store at this point or it's still um, Not that I know of, Jimmy. <laughs> no, I think, as I said, I think, you know, our performances have been quite good. We, we've thrown away points that we, um, you know, as I said, if we were a little bit more attention to detail at key moments, we, we would have picked up some extra points. So I think that's the, the main focus for us.